Hey now, this is Jenna Flower at Abundance Amplified Tarot and more. Thank you for all your likes, shares, and subscribes. And thank you for the donations. I'm going to be able to give away some free readings here soon. I'm so excited. Uh, let's get into this reading. Pisces. Beautiful. Okay, be assertive. Seven of Spring. Don't look back down from what you believe. Don't back down, okay? This is where you're coming into this future renewal here. You've been really working on pulling that energy, your power back into yourself. And congratulations, okay? You've courageously learned how to st stand up for yourself. Coming into this period of renewal, all right? Review the past and the present so you can plan a new future, understanding your life purpose, releasing judgments for yourself and others. Basically, you are building your freedom here, okay? We all are. So um, just know that you should be celebrating any small win, any large win. You've done some great work here. We also have the Queen of Autumn, generous, stylish, gracious, and practical. Look at how beautiful she is. Queen of Wands energy here, okay? Be practical with respect on how you proceed. The ability to make anything more beautiful. Meeting someone who can help your dreams come true. I'm getting this for a lot of people. There's amazing partnerships that are coming in for folks right now. Okay. Um, know that you are calling this in for yourself. I'm going to go ahead and pull a shaman card for you. What a lovely season we're in. Harvest season for so many people. And if you're not in that space right now, know that every day is a new day. Okay? Every day is a new day. You get to create your reality to some extent here, right? You get to pick and choose what is working for you and what is not working for you. Yeah, we understand that this has been a period of growth. All right? And action. You guys have been doing a lot, a lot, a lot to bring in this, all right? You have gone through, as you started to move forward, you were facing obstacles, whether it was internal obstacles or external obstacles. Know that there is victory and celebration coming in for you, okay? I've got this King of Swords. If those of you are waiting for clarity, all right, and this could have been from, you know, kind of reflecting, letting go of things that are no longer serving you. Again, I feel like this is internal obstacles, right? You're going to be moving forward in a very balanced way and you are promised abundance here. Wow, 10 of wands, you're gonna go straight in to a harvest season here. And I feel like where some of you guys might've been tentative a while back, that that is not the case anymore. That is not the case. What do we have for Pisces spirit? Thank you. Oh, oh, hold on. Yeah. I've got share your voice. Come out of the cave. Persecution. Expression. It's time to stand up for who you are. Okay? Possibly establishing better boundaries. I love that card, right? Look at how all these people are reaching out. When you start to shine your light... Sometimes that pulls people towards you that necessarily no longer serve you. That energy no longer serves you. And it's a chance for you to right, align your life and really solidify in what you want in your life and what you don't want in your life. So view it as an opportunity. Okay, some of you have had to make some decisions recently. All right. You've been going back and forth. What do I want to do? What don't I want to do? You have stopped looking backwards. When you stop looking in the past, okay, that's when things are going to happen for you. Your spirit team is guiding you into celebrations here. I feel like you kind of feel right now that you're overburdened, okay, misunderstood, I'm hearing, um, defeated, frustrated, like I hear somebody out there, why doesn't this ever work for me? I keep doing all the right things. Okay, keep clearing that residual stuff and know that this is coming in for you. Stand in your truth. Remember we talked about this, right? Express yourself. Stand in your truth. It might feel like a risk, okay? But it's actually bringing you into complete authenticity, I've got three freedom through faith coming out for you. 
I claim my thoughts and rise above fear. I free myself of all doubt by entrusting my doubts to God. I have faith in God's perfect timing and placement, right? I trust in his will and find freedom. Now, if you don't like God in so in that particular way, right? You can think of spirit, of truth, of clarity, of source, okay? The higher self, right? It's about having faith. Let's not get stuck in the details. Let's grab that message, right? I allow serenity to reign in me. I love the love I have for myself invites harmony to settle within my being. I listen to honor and strive to fulfill the needs of my soul. Okay, so I like the word desires better. Uh, we all have innate desires. We do have needs, right? Food, clothing, shelter, all of that stuff. Um, again, please remember to like, share, and subscribe if this is resonating with you. Let's get this message out to people that need it. Spirit uh, is, this is a really magical yet precarious time for a lot of folks on the planet, okay? People need support, right? Your emotions, okay? This is what spirit has been helping you with. This is your shadow work that you've been doing. And you're standing in this Knight of Cups energy here. Okay, you are ready to move forward in action. Okay, know the battle's over. Please take good care of yourselves. Take care of each other. And as always, be kind out there.